Um, Frank DeVille. I'm a complete weirdo. Like I'm the straight edge kid who's never had a drink. I'm like atheist, libertarian, like nutbag. Nut, can I say nut job? Can we say, don't put nut bag. I don't want to describe myself as a nut bag. I'm a nut job, not a nut bag. There's a big difference. Um, so I'm kind of a wacko. And I'm a professional magician. All right, here we go. Just about to start the show, beginning with the oldest trick in the book. This first trick is 7,000 years old. It has been performed for pharaohs, for kings, queens, presidents, today for you. Beginning with ball number one, a tap and it's gone. Moving to two, a tap it goes to. The third is the hardest one because you already know what to watch for. So watch me close, I like a challenge. Three cups, three balls. Cup for every ball, ball for every cup. They'll vanish from the ends. And meet in the middle. Now the reason the trick is so tough to track is because you just have two eyes and I have three balls. Mom said I'm special. You I think one of the reasons I got good was I went out and I sucked. Street performing is a whole separate skill set aside from the, the magic tricks. I mean, basically, you have to stop people who have no intentions, no plans of watching a show. You got to keep them there for as long as the show lasts. And then you have to have them give you money when it's easier for them to walk away. And you guys thought I sucked. If I found him folded Marina's card with just teeth, tongue, and lips, I'd get a big round of applause and a hat full of tips. Oh, of course. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you're awesome. Oh, thank you. It's very nice for someone else to say so. I thought I was watching TV. I never would have gone out if my father didn't help. Because it's terrifying to set up in a spot. Am, am I allowed to do this? Or am I gonna look like an asshole when I try to get money? And so my father, who was a retired engineer, military 20 years, so about as conservative in that way as you could be. And my dad actually went with me and hung out while I did my first couple shows. And then once I got through that, it was fine. But he was really supportive. I mean, I, I, I had the best dad I ever could have hoped for. I do pretty well. And so I was getting a bit sad that my dad didn't get to see any of that. Pretty much every day I go out there, I perform. There it goes. And I really do like performing. And when you get a fun crowd, when you get a good crowd, it's like, it's like the easiest thing in the world. It's so much fun. Please act impressed. That took me 10 years. I could have been a doctor. <laughs> in my show, I always say, look, if you don't have any money, I understand. Please stay, enjoy the show. Like, but just let me know you enjoyed the show. Just come up, tell me you like the show, because everybody can afford a kind word. Like, I mean it. And I'm starting to think maybe that's not fair, because maybe I'm asking them still to, maybe they're shy or embarrassed. I don't know. But like, I love that people are able to get a little bit from me, to get something great from my show that they couldn't get anywhere else. <laughs> 